I tried to give myself Sabrina Carpenter bangs and this is where we landed. If you wanna see the process of how I got here, definitely go ahead and check out my Instagram because I did post a reel. At first I wasn't sure if I liked it or not, but I am really growing to love it. Ignore the man behind the curtain right here. He's just trying to get himself comfortable and struggling quite a bit. Oh my gosh, his fur is so staticky. It is just going in all different directions. Oh, this is going to be part two of my cozy clothing haul with Quince. I have so many coats and jackets to show you in this haul that I am so, so excited. The weather is finally cooling down, so I'm able to wear all of my knitwear and cozy cashmeres. It's a vibe and I'm here for it. If you're new here, hello and welcome. My name is Amy. Thank you so much for hanging out with me today. This video is in collaboration with Quince and I'm so excited to share with you seven pieces that I am itching to wear this fall season. If you're unfamiliar with Quince, you are in for a treat because it is just one of my favorite favorite brands. They have the most timeless classic pieces that belong in a capsule wardrobe for such affordable prices. It's kind of unreal when I see the price tag of these because the quality just feels so exponentially more than what you have to pay for. Their selection of designs is absolutely crazy. I mean, you can find anything and everything there. They have shoes, jackets, knitwear, cashmere, bodysuits, tanks, just, I mean, the list it just goes on and on, so I will just stop there. I'm not even exaggerating when I say this. I have never been disappointed by a single item that I got from Quince so far. I also feel like in the fall, I find the best things at Quince. So definitely go ahead and check them out. I'll go ahead and put everything in the description that I feature in today's video. As always in my try-on hauls, I'll go over my sizing, what I think about the style, the material, the quality, all that good stuff. Without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right in. Okay, I'm really hoping my camera is not tilted, but if it is, just forgive me. The first item I have to share with you is this beautiful cashmere hoodie. It is called Mongolian Cashmere Fisherman Pullover Hoodie, and it's in the color oatmeal. This is undeniably my favorite thing from this haul because I am always looking for pieces that I can lounge around at home, be super comfortable and cozy, but still looking really chic and elevated. And this gives me exactly that. Also, can we just talk about the fit of this? It is absolute perfection. I love how this looks like it fits me really, really well, but it's still loose and slightly boxy. The sleeve length cannot be any better on me because it goes down right to where my rings are on my fingers. So it does cover my palms, which I love when I'm wearing like hoodies and sweaters and stuff like that. I love the design of this because it does come with an actual hood and it has little drawstrings. This grade A Mongolian cashmere is absolutely so, so so soft. For these types of cashmere pieces, Quince also uses their pelling resistance materials so you don't have to worry too much about getting those little fuzzies that ball up and looks a little raggedy, you know? I have a ton of other cashmere pieces from Quince and I've never had excessive pilling on any of their clothing items, which I am a huge fan of. In terms of the length, it hits me at the right spot on my body. You could probably describe this as hip length and if you wanted to, you could definitely tuck this in or tuck the end of this into your bra or something and make it cropped if you wanted to. But I really love just being effortless, loose on my body. It's just so, so cozy. This would also be a fantastic gift for your loved ones, like family members and friends, because it's such a classic style. You can't go wrong. I feel like no one would dislike this style of hoodie. Definitely look into this if you're looking for a gift for someone for Christmas or their birthdays during the fall and winter season. I highly recommend. In terms of the sizing, I got this in an extra small and I would say that this fits me perfectly. It fits me like a glove. I definitely wouldn't size up or down in this. However, if you do want it to be very, very oversized on you, then you, you know, feel free to size up if you'd like. Or if you want it to fit a little bit closer to your body, you can size down. Down. The second piece I am also really looking forward to wearing. If you have seen a couple of my previous videos, you will know how much I adore the knit sweater vest situation. And I have this one. It is in the color black, so sorry if you can't see the details very well. It might be kind of washed out, but it is a beautiful v-neck and it has this kind of cable knit pattern on it as well, which I love. And it is consistent throughout on the back as well. 
In my opinion, I feel like everyone should own at least one sweater vest in their wardrobe because one of the best reasons to have one is because it just makes your look so effortlessly chic and it takes literally no effort. There are so many different ways to wear it as well. It's such a versatile piece. You can just wear this alone. You can also layer this on top of a button down or even just a tighter fitting long sleeve if you wanted to layer for more colder weather. This looks good with jeans. You can also put on some faux leather pants or a mini skirt with tights, boots. Oh my gosh. I mean, the possibilities are endless. This one is so, so comfortable and I love the fit of it because it does fit slightly oversized and boxy. I did purchase this in a size extra small and I definitely would stick to your normal size. I also love the length of it because it is right between your waist and your hips. The material is super soft and slightly stretchy, so it's very comfortable. This style also comes in different colors as well, but I definitely needed to add a black one because surprisingly enough, I have vests in other colors like beige, white. I have a gray and a brown, but I was missing a black. So I am set for my sweater vest collection. It is just everything to me. I love it. I feel like it's not a proper fall clothing haul unless you have at least one cardigan. This one is a beautiful one made from organic cotton. It feels super thick and durable. I have a feeling that this will definitely keep you very warm and cozy. The color of this is an off-white. I'm not sure if you can tell on the camera, but it doesn't pull too yellow. I love the button details right here. They are this really pretty marled, marled, brown swirly color. I have accumulated so many different types of cardigans from Quince. Let me know if you would like a video fully dedicated to showing all of my different cardigans from Quince. I will definitely make that video for you. Just let me know in the comments. This one definitely fits kind of in between a classic fit and a boyfriend type of fit. It's right in the middle. It doesn't look super oversized on me or anything like that. I got this in a size extra small and it fits me perfectly. I always say this though, if you want it to fit looser, size up. If you want it to fit closer to your body, you can size down. Moving right along to the jackets and then I have one coat to show you, but starting with the jackets, this is a suede biker jacket in the color sand and just look how gorgeous it is. I really love these types of mid-weight jackets for the fall season because it's chilly enough where you need something to cover you up, but you also don't want to be hauling around like a parka or <laughs> something super thick and heavy. So this is just the right balance. Biker jackets instantly give your look an edge to it. It, which I think is so cool. Even if you have just a really simple basic tank top underneath, but you have this over top of it, you just instantly look cooler. This is 100% suede and it just feels so soft and buttery smooth. You can tell by the touch that it's very substantial and the quality of the suede is really, really good. The hardware is silver, which goes really well with this cool tone gray. This color is really interesting because it is somewhere in between a white and a gray. It's almost like a very, very pale light gray, which I think would go with a lot of different colors. So it's very versatile. The waist and the arm length works really well for me. The only thing that I will point out, there is a zipper part on the sleeves, on both sleeves. And I have to unzip it for it to be comfortable around my wrists because if I have it closed, then it can be a little stuffy. So for me personally, I'm just gonna have these unzipped at all times and it should be fine. This jacket is also fully lined on the inside, which is very, very important to me. This is a perfect transitional jacket from fall to winter or winter to spring. It's great. I got this in a size extra small and it fits true to size as well. This jacket is probably my second favorite thing from this haul. This is the featherless quilted long puffer jacket. I got it in the color olive. I just need to get up close and personal because look how beautiful the texture of this coat is. It also has really cool buttons because these are gold hardware and the zipper too. It just goes really well with this olive color and it gives a slightly vintagey feel to it. I have so many things that I love about this jacket, but first off, these pockets are incredible. They are so, so deep and gigantic. So you can fit like a couple of phones in here and your wallet and there's absolutely no risk of them falling out of your jacket. It has thermal insulation and it's made out of recycled bottles, which, which is just phenomenal. This is what the back looks like and I love the silhouette of this. I have been looking for a quilted jacket like this and I'm so glad that I found it on Quince. This just gives me all the fall vibes. I feel like I need to go 
and do some apple picking or something. I grabbed this in an extra small and I definitely think it's true to size. I will say if you want to stuff this with multiple layers underneath, I try sizing up. I don't think you can fit too many layers under this unless you size one up. However, if I just have a typical sweater on and I put this over it, it's, it's not gonna cause me any issues. It doesn't feel super constricting around the arms or anything like that. I believe this is one of Quince's newer styles on their website and it is called Italian Wool Double Breasted Slouch Coat. I got it in the color Cadet, which is kind of their dark navy blue color. Let me get closer so you can see that. Recently, I've been wanting to add more navy colors into my wardrobe because it's just such a timeless and effortless color to wear in the fall and winter. I mean, all year around, to be honest, but I really love my navies in the colder season for some reason. This coat immediately went on my wish list because it just looks so, so warm and cozy. This covers my entire body, so this is going to provide so much warmth, especially in the winter. The material is super thick and it feels very durable. The arm length works really, really well on me, and when I have this on, I just feel like I need to go Christmas shopping or something. <laughs> I'm super excited for the holidays. Again, I feel like I'm always just so pleasantly surprised by Quince's price tag and their affordability because these types of wool coats are not cheap, and I am just surprised that they are able to provide it at such a good price, but it just looks so expensive and elegant. It's definitely super weighty. I feel like my arms are about to fall off trying to hold this for so long. In terms of sizing, I got this in an extra small and definitely stick to your normal size. The final piece I actually saved for last because it doesn't actually fit in with any of the other items that I just showed you because it is a bodysuit. And I actually own one of these already, but in a different color. I wanted to pick up a black one because I recently tried on a bodysuit that I already owned in my closet and I didn't love how it fit on me. So I am going to replace that one with this because I know that I love how this looks on me. This is so, so comfortable and the material is buttery soft. Very, very stretchy and flexible. Such a great layering piece. I love the style of this because it is a square neck. The straps are on the thinner side and it does come with the gusset being like the snap opening enclosure. So you can go to the bathroom easily. The back is really sexy too because it has this little bit of a scoop. In terms of sizing, I did size up in a small because for most bodysuits, I tend to do that anyway. My torso is on the longer side for someone who is as short as I am. I'm only 5'2", 5'3", but my torso always runs more of like a standard person, if that makes any sense. So I always size up, especially because they're just a little bit more comfortable that way anyway. The small works really well on me. I feel like if I did get my normal size, it probably would work as well because they are super slinky, but I just wanted to be on the safe side and get the small instead. It works really well for me, but bodysuits are very, very specific in terms of sizing. So it might be kind of a hit or miss. You kind of have to evaluate it yourself. But I will say if you have experience with other bodysuits, then you can try going with that size. If you have a longer torso like me, then definitely go ahead and size up and you should be okay. Highly recommend. These, I feel like I'm gonna start collecting in different colors. And that is everything. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. A huge thank you goes to Quince for sponsoring this video. I'll go ahead and link every single product that I talked about in the description below. Definitely go ahead and check them out and show them some love. They have so many cute fall styles dropping all the time. Before we part ways, if you want something else to watch, definitely go ahead and check out my previous video right here. I would love for you to stick around for a little bit longer. Please like if you haven't already, subscribe if you wanna stick around and I'll talk to you in the comments, bye.